the Les Long in-house band. How y'all doing out there today? Good, good. Y'all could be anywhere in the world, but you're here with me, so, and my ego. So I thank you for tolerating me. Welcome to the Les Long Show, because you know more when you know less. The Les Long Show is not about Les Long. It bears my name and it bears my face, but the Les Long Show is all about giving you exposure. Talent is not what you lack. You just lack exposure. Entrepreneurs, business owners, artists, musicians, poets, what have you, comedians, here is your platform in North Carolina to get out to the world what you're doing. We're hitting over three, we have an opportunity to hit over three million homes. So, with that being said, we're going to jump right into the show. Barack Obama, just a few weeks ago, toe into that boy. I bet you that little man that called him a liar hate it right now. Oh, I know he hate because he know Barack can get you plucked off. <laughs> I know he's sitting back thinking about, I didn't call that man a liar, and he didn't track down that dude. You know, they could have been found um, Osama bin Laden. All they had to do was figure out where all the just for men was going to in that country, they could have found it. <laughs> anyway, that's enough for me. We're going to get on to the show right after these commercial breaks. <laughs> This is Richard Brown. Richard is an entrepreneur. Uh, we happen to grow up in the same town, same county, Lewisburg, North Carolina, in the building. Shout out to the bird, please. Yes. L.A., Lewisburg area. Because I didn't grow up in town. I grew up in the country part. Yes. There's a stoplight. Really? Let's be honest. Yeah. What we're dealing with. Yeah. Our community. Yeah, I was like, yeah, man, yeah, country, you know, just, yeah. Anyway, Richard has a television show, and one thing about the Less Long Show is that I'm all about bonding and 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 and, and helping other people grow what they have. So just because he has a television show and he's a host, I'm not going to hold that against him. Thank you. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Because I want his show to be as successful as mine, if not more successful. Because if he is more successful, then he's going to have me come on his show. And we're going to dialogue. We're gonna do this well, look, I want you to tell him about what you do. Because your show, you, you go into some areas that I don't go into as far as sometimes the subject matter. Um, you, you talk a lot more serious issues. I just try to bring awareness to who we have in our community and what they do as far as their talents or their businesses. But a lot of times, you, you kind of go after them. So just tell them about, about your show and what time it comes on and just lay it out there. Just the whole nine. Give, give folks the elevator speech. So the Richard Brown Show really deals with issues in the African-American community. So what I'll have is, of course, I'll have less long multiple times. But part of what we talk about is issues around health, issues around education, issues that I believe, see far too often, you know, me and, me and you, we can kind of chat and, and talk about stuff, but sometimes they have us on TV looking crazy, looking just as foolish as they want to be. And so, I, I, I hate you. <laughs> Go ahead, get in there. If an accident happened outside this building, it's a lot of well-dressed, Good looking black folks in here. That's right. They gonna people. stop, and I have nothing against homeless people. I like to try to help homeless people. But they gonna pick somebody, all us in here, hundreds of people in this in this building. They gonna get the guy with no teeth for system. Ain't head nigher than mine. Ain't beige. So what did you see, sir? See what I have for? And then 
Can I get a quarter after I finish? And then, but that's what they do to us. But that's what they do. And so part of what I want to do is make sure that we show the other side. We show less is more, but we also show a more serious conversation about what's happening in our community. We're showing the teachers, we're showing the lawyers, we're showing the doctors, and we're showing these folks because our community needs to see them along with those crazy folks. Because let's be clear, they're part of our community too. You remember them folks in our community that was, they won't write. But that's all right because that can't be the only image that they show. And that's our job. That's your job. So. Doesn't Richard articulate very well? No. He's very well versed. Oh, uh, let's let's be clear now. Now we from the same country, country spot, and I be splitting verbs with the best of them when I get to the house. But I do try to present myself yes. with a yes. certain type of yes. English vocabulary. Oh yes, because <laughs> my vernacular can get quite spectacular on momentous and monumental occasions. Wow, wow! Can you say that five times fast? See, you're trying to embarrass me on TV. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, Richard, if people want to tune in to your show or if they have a story that they think is newsworthy, how can they get in contact with you and your people and get the word, up, word out about what's going on in the community? Well, the first thing you need to do is go to the Less Long website. Now, after you go to the Less Long website, then you go to richardbrownshow.com. First, Less Long then richardbrownshow.com. Everything's there. The show, when Les come on the show and we're going to be cutting up, that's going to be on there. It ain't even there yet, but it's going to be on there. That's what you hit. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is Mr. Richard Brown. Y'all give it up for him and the Les Long Show. Yeah.